this is a video made from me. But guess what? We also have a special surprise. Not many people do this, I'm sure, but we have a Charizard in the house and a unicorn in the house. We are going to be painting, painting them, them both. Yes, both of them. Frog Sprout is going to be helping me. So yeah. we are going to be painting with acrylic. Because Everybody get some paper to paint on to keep the table and the countertop clean. Do quick look. <laughs> My paper. <laughs> okay, she is just making this in here. So okay, what I'm going to do is um, the wings first. Blue and see how it looks. <gasps> Pink hat. Oh, I'm Okay, remember just a little, a little button of paint is needed. So when you make circles of paint, make sure it's smaller than that. Okay. Okay. So Here's your water. We will need a very tiny brush. Let's see. I got a very tiny brush. Y'all have a paper towel. This is perfect. protects you. dip in the white because okay. otherwise it won't because then it won't be white anymore see everybody's working on hi Zuzi oh here's a paper towel to wipe your hand on okay Whoop. let's see your Costco haul <laughs> okay oh, and you're getting your sleeve on your rock so we like to paint rocks and 3d printed objects we got these objects free from our public library. Ooh, I like Charizard's wings. I know, that's the color of his wings. I see. And that is very important. Yeah, I, I, for, I forgot that. that. So guys, I don't know about you, but I think you like pretty stuff because it's just fun. See it with your family. <gasps> no, no, no. Wait, what mistake did you do? Oh my gosh, I need a happy face on this. creation the big eyes to make it look a, be a bit cuter and it <laughs> kind of looks a bit more realistic but there's also a mess up eye. <laughs> the wings are so freaking awesome. And the toenails. Yeah, you can get your own paper towel please. Well I'm almost done with my well, But now I'm going to use some golden purple. 
Maiden is painting a still life. Dragon Sprout is painting a still life. Yeah, looking cool. I even painted the teeth. Mm -hmm. Notice. Cool 3D printers. Okay, so we had fun painting, but what is an important step of painting, of when you're painting? No mix, what? No mix, what do we do at the end? Do we just leave all the brushes out, all the paint open? No. All the dirty water sitting? No. So little brother can get to them. <laughs> no, we, can't. we get to clean up. Over here. Rinse off the major stuff in here. Then dry it off and then you can rinse it in water. Do any of you wonder how you get so 3D printed? You go to your local library. And some libraries don't have it. But if you live in the Salt Lake County, yeah. there's lots of 3D printers at many of the libraries. You ask the library for a slip. Uh, you have to write down what you want and I'm pretty sure you also have to write down your library card. Yeah, number. library card number, your name, phone number, yeah. and file number. And if you want to have find cool files to 3D print, go to a page called Thingiverse. Thingiverse has all sorts of templates and files for 3D printing. So you can tell them, okay, this is the file I want, and the library looks it up and connects it to their 3D printing machine and then they print stuff. Let's look at the one that uh, that Eli got. It's a Charizard, but if you look close enough, it actually came in pieces. It look very yep. close. It came in pieces, you have to glue it together. The arms came in separate pieces, the head and the wings. Uh -huh. They print it separately, pieces. So, check out with your local library, see if they have a 3D printer. Cause it's fun to go there, give them files. <laughs> if you can't find one, then you should probably ask uh, one of the people who work there. And if they say there is no um, 3D printer there, then you should just go to Salt Lake to pay a visit. <laughs> and pay a visit to Salt Lake. Cool, thanks. Well, I now am, they know. Now you know I how to get a 3D. I'm very glad that they were able to 3D print this. Yeah, and Aiden thought it was so cool. He ordered another Charizard yesterday, so. Uh-huh, and it took me a week and a half to get this. Yeah, they call you and say, hey, your 3D print is ready, and you can go pick it up, so very fun. Okay, thanks guys for watching our episode about 3D printing and painting our 3D printed objects. I'll give you a tour of our, this is Brett's bonsai tree. It is an acerola plant, which is like a Brazilian cherry. Anyways, he's into bonsais and plants. <laughs> he takes care of all these plants. <laughs>